The central theme of Pichwai paintings revolves around the stories of Lord Krishna, majorly from his early years. Pichwai is a Sanskrit word in which pich stands for back and vai stands for hanging. As mentioned before, the main character of these paintings is Lord Krishna. However, the themes vary from Lord Krishna's childhood tales, Radha Krishna paintings to various festivals celebrating Krishna like Janmashtami, Govardhan Puja, Sharad Purnima, Holi, etc. Due to the cultural and historical significance, pitchways are used for a variety of purposes including decorations, home interiors and even to illustrate the tales of Krishna. The color palette for a pitchway painting is prepared in such a way that it exudes a fabulously aesthetic touch. Raja Ravi Verma was an Indian painter and artist. He is considered among the greatest painters in the history of Indian art. His works are one of the best examples of the fusion of European academic art with a purely Indian sensibility and iconography. He was known as the first modern Indian artist. He was also notable for making affordable lithographs of his paintings available to the public, which greatly enhanced his reach and influence as a painter and public figure. Furthermore, his religious depictions of Hindu deities and works from Indian epic poetry and Puranas have received profound acclaim. Anjo paintings are known for the extravagant depictions of deities using vibrant colors and gaudy embellishments, especially gold foil. Though the art form has undergone various changes over the years, it continues to be popular with art lovers even today and inspires many artists with its truly Indian style. In modern times, these paintings have become souvenirs for festive occasions in southern India. Thangka painting symbolizes the Buddhist Tibetan culture. It is one of the most well-known Asian art forms which is included in the Abhidharma, also known as the Art of Enlightenment, and is considered to be a branch of Asian culture. Over the years, thangas have evolved from a genuinely pure spiritual art form to a style. To paint a thangka, one must have extraordinary talent and knowledge. There are many different types of thangkas, ranging from inexpensive mass-produced tourist souvenirs to exquisite paintings that might take several months to finish.